What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Gemini, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading for Sonic Gemini. This is the ETF of Gemini any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Maintain, Energy, Group, Charts. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. If it warm, pass free will. That's too many. Only take the messages that resonate, leave the rest. Free general oracle card reading for June of 2022 for Sun and Gemini. I would suggest everybody to uh, check out your Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node signs if you're interested in more messages in your other placements if you feel guided to do so. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 13,015 subscribers, so thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. I really, really, really appreciate it from the bottom of my heart chakra. It helps support a single mom in one of her income streams, single mom and two kids. So I really, really uh, appreciate each and every one of you guys. I do, I do, I do. Okay. Also, I did a hashtag meme drop in the new moon and Gemini energy um, over a period of three days. Um, there's lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of memes on the community tab on my channel. If anybody's interested, you're welcome to view them, share them with friends, neighbors, frenemies, community members, social media people, people you don't know, etc., etc., etc. If you feel guided to do so or not, however that resonates and applies in one's life, okay? Also, if you feel guided to share my channel, very publicly in social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate that as well. Spirit messages you have to have of a Gemini. I did receive a couple channel messages as I was meditating on your energy for June of 2022. Um, the first one, I heard erectile dysfunction. And the second one, I heard sex videos are about to go, are about to be leaked and go viral. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, I would be careful with leaking somebody, um, I just want to disclaimer this. If you're not in the sex video, it would not be smart to share a sex video that you don't have rights and somebody, especially somebody did not consent to having it being shared. I wouldn't share it because that could be lawsuit energy. Of course, you can choose to listen to that advice or not, but I'm just letting somebody know because I mean, I have been getting sex video viral energy in here very strong the past couple days. And for a lot of these situations, these people are not in the sex videos. It's somebody else in the sex videos. So, I mean, you could take the advice or leave it. But if it was me, I wouldn't be sharing no sex videos that I'm not in. Because you don't want to be in. What, 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 who's to say they didn't sign consent or authorization for them to be, um, to be shared or exposed? You don't want to be in the middle of a lawsuit. I mean, of course, you could take the advice or leave it. But I wouldn't. But some, uh, I mean, in some of these situations, it could be them intentionally leaking them, having other people intentionally leak them. They could have signed consent and authorization and they're getting paid for it. But if you know somebody did not consent, like hidden camera energy, I wouldn't share that shit, but that's just me. Everybody has free will, okay? But you plug it in, how it resonates with some kind of erectile dysfunction energy. Um, that could be you that has erectile dysfunction or somebody you're connected to. Anybody doesn't know, ED is basically, in men, it's, this is the penis. It's hard to get it up. So, Viagra or Cialis or something like that helps it get hard. Not trying to be crass, but that, you know, just saying. Spirit messages you have a sign of Gemini. And some kind of sex video energy. Like I said, I don't know if this is, they have signed consent and authorization and they're getting paid off this, or it was hidden camera energy. I didn't hear the specifics of that, but some kind of sex video energy is about to go very viral. And I didn't hear if you were in this Gemini in the sex video or if it was somebody connected to you, but some kind of sex video energy is about to go viral. Maybe we'll hear more here in a minute, okay? And we have the rabbit card, which is, Doing it like rabbits, sexual energy, sex video energy. Lord have mercy. Spirit messages you have, Son Gemini.
your messages here of Sanjima. A divorce is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. Some you want this divorce, some you do not. A divorce is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. For some of you guys, you want this divorce. For some, you don't. So only you know your story, not anybody else. So you have to plug the messages in that resonate and leave the rest. Some, you want the divorce. So for some, I think you're initiating it. Um, the divorce. For some, you don't want the divorce. So... Only you know your story, not anybody else. I don't know if it's contested. I don't know if it's going to be. Um, sounds like it's upcoming in the universe, so it hasn't happened yet. Um, but for some, you could have already had the talk with your spouse, possibly. But I don't know if it's going to be contested or non-contested. Only you know that, not anybody else. One of you guys might be stubborn, or somebody you're connected to might be stubborn. It's taking forever to, uh, forever to get these cards out. Spirit messages you have signed, a Gemini. Or that, honestly, that could be the person's penis not getting up, too. Stubbornness. No. Ew. I try to be crass, but I'm being serious. Spirit message did you have sign Gemini. So we have changes in your life with the world. That's the divorce energy, whether you want the divorce or not. That's the erectile dysfunction, whether that's you or somebody you're connected to. That's the sex video energy. Um, yeah, changes in your life coupled with the world. Holy moly. Sphere of Institute Shops on Gemini. Someone is about to be surprised terminated soon. Someone is about to be surprised terminated soon. Holy crap. Now that could be you or somebody you're connected to. Um, but someone's about to be terminated soon. I don't know if this if it's a wrongful termination or a rightful termination. But somebody's about to be uh, terminated soon. Whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, Gemini. For some, you could be dealing with the earth sign. I strongly feel for some, you are. You have double earth sign energy, mouse, and rabbit energy. If you are, they could have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, Orco, and Midham, and Jupiter charts. You plug it in how it resonates. Mouse and rabbit. Number 29 could be a very significant number in one's life as well. Number 29, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number in one's life. Number 29, mouse. A very sneaky person is about to get into a Gemini's phone soon, about to learn their passcode, and about to get very important information. You're about to learn this through intuitive spikes when you realize this person knows way more than you ever told them. You plug it in how it resonates, though. Oh. So sneaky, shysty, um, quiet like a mouse energy. I feel it's like quiet like a mouse energy, sneaky, quiet like a mouse energy. Whoever you are, Gemini, um, you can be a masculine or femme Gemini. It could be an earth sign that's about to do this or somebody else. But however it resonates, um, whoever this person is, they're about to go. I heard they're about to get in your phone. They haven't done it yet. Sounds like they're about to in the universe. They're about to get into your phone and get some very important information in some shape, form, or fashion for some. Hell, I don't, I don't know what kind of information they're about to get, but they are about to get something. And whatever they're about to get, it sounds like they're about to send it to themselves or send it to themselves and other people. But however that resonates, I heard you're going to get intuitive spikes. It sounds like upcoming after they do this because they haven't done this yet. It's upcoming in the universe. But it sounds like through conversations with this person, you're going to realize... Um, that they got the information and you never told them you never told them the information so how did they get it kind of energy well 
for some it's because they went through your phone just saying just saying uh, but but you're going to be conversating with them and intuitively you're going to i think you're going to think to yourself well hell i never told them that well because for some of you guys you didn't they went through your phone um, it hasn't happened yet it sounds like it's upcoming for some australian feels an earth sign I'm about to do this of course capricorn virgo but it could be any other sign possibly you just have double earth sign energy but you plug it in how it resonates Mm, mm, mm. So quiet like a mouse, sneaky energy. Family embarrassment coming soon. Family embarrassment coming soon. So this could be your family about to get embarrassed or somebody you're connected to's family about to get embarrassed with some kind of family embarrassment energy. Um, maybe you have earth signs in your family about to get embarrassed or somebody fam else's family full of earth signs or any other sign about to get family embarrassed um you plug it in how it resonates lord rabbit a wannabe porn star is about to become very significant in a gemini's life air sign energy oh a wannabe porn star is about to become very significant in a gemini's life soon air sign energy heard wannabe porn star so i don't think they're actually famous like um what's her name um uh, debbie does dallas or um um double d dixie jugs or um you know the really famous ones or like ron jeremy or something like that you hear the sirens that's confirmation sirens confirmation so i don't think they're really famous like that porn star energy I heard they, oh, hold on a second. Okay. Sorry. Well, it sounded like they were coming closer and closer very quickly. They're going the other way. Um, so, yeah. But um, it's something, they're not famous like that. They're not like Ron Jeremy, Debbie Does Dallas, Double D Jugs, or something like that. It's, um, they want to be famous like a porn star, basically. It's an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. They could have Gemini, Gemini Libra, Aquarius, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. It's not you. It's an air sign you're connected to. This is your porn star sexual energy. You know, doing it like rabbits. Like when, the, um, not fun when the rabbit has a gun kind of energy. Porn star energy all day long. Air sign. Want to be porn star several shocking series of time events are about to occur with to this want to be porn, porn star you're about to be shocked several shocking series of time events are about to occur to uh, occur with this want to be porn star you're about to be shocked so you plug it in how it resonates lord i have many goals and aspirations in life but a want to be porn star is not one of them but that's just me i can only speak on myself not anybody else the world Cycles are about to really, really change fast in a particular Gemini's life. For some, you don't want them to, but they are about to change whether you want them to or not. Okay, I heard several cycles are about to change in many Gemini's lives. For some of you guys, you don't want them to change, but some you do. And they're about to change whether you want to or not. So 555, five, 8 of Wands energy, change, fast change, world, cycle change, with changes in your life. I mean, it's all over the place in here. Um, for some, you want them to change. For some, you don't. So, you know, only you know your story, not anybody else. But this is not cog in the wheel, wheel energy. It's natural, energetic flow in the universe. It's not somebody intentionally putting a cog in the in the cycle. It is going to change whether you want it to or not. No cog in the wheel energy here. Wow. Doll. A particular Gemini is about to realize a sister is hiding something about someone they grew up with. Huge illness. This Gemini is about to ask this sister soon about this. 
Okay, so you plug in and how it resonates. So a Gemini, if this resonates for you, Gemini, you have a sister. Um, it could be a biological sister, half sister, foal sister, foster sister, somebody you call sister. But how that resonates, um, um, I heard you realize that she's hiding some kind of huge illness of someone from her past. I mean, someone of y'all's past that y'all grew up with. You're about to ask her about it. So she knows about this illness of this person y'all grew up with, but you don't. So you're about to ask the sister, either blood sister or you call her sister, however that resonates. Um, I didn't hear what kind of illness it is, but it sounds like it's pretty serious, however that resonates, okay? Doll. A significant gift to a Gemini is about to come very significant soon. And a, a gift a Gemini is about to give someone is about to come very significant soon. Okay. A significant gift about to be given to a Gemini is about to come very significant. And for some of you guys, a gift you're about to give to somebody is about to come very significant. So that's the world card, cycle change energy with the gift energy, whether you're receiving the gift or you're giving the gift or both. Because, you know, energies can be reversed with changes with the gift. Whether you're giving it, you're receiving it, or both, you plug it in how it resonates. Um, hopefully, it's not like anthrax in the damn mail. Hopefully, it's something very positive. Um, let me see if I hear what it is. For one, it's a gift card. For one, it's an appreciation plaque at work. For one, it's a gift card. For one, it's an appreciation plaque at work. Well, that's beautiful. So for one of you guys, it's a gift card. And for one, it's an appreciation plaque at work. So you plug that in, however that resonates. If that resonates for you, Gemini, that's really beautiful. It really is. Changes in your life. And one Gemini is about to have to give back a very, very, very large amount of money. An illegal case study that was done on a family. Forgery of signature. HOH did not consent. It's about to piss this Gemini off in a huge way. That could be the changes in your life too. If you were the low vibrational Gemini that has a bunch of stolen money from a family, basically. I've been pulling this in the past couple days. Confirmation from Fat Boy, by the way. Come on, come on, baby. Um, there is a family out there in the universe somewhere that basically got taken advantage of with an illegal warrior camera in their home. Um, it was a group of people that took advantage of them. They never got them help. They took advantage of them, profited off of them, and then forced a signature of consent that they consented to it, but they never did. And all these people profited huge, large amounts of money off the case study with people voyeuring in, viewing them through the camera in their home. And they did not, the, had, a, had a household, it was a single parent, had a household, they did not consent. But somebody forged the signature of this head of household to give consent. But in reality, the head of household did not consent. They did not consent. It was illegal voyeur camera energy. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Now, I don't know if this is you that did this or somebody you're connected to, but it's somebody very, very low vibrational that did it. But at least one low vibrational Gemini in the universe, they they got money off this illegal case study, I'll tell you that. So they know somebody forged the signature. And I heard basically they're about to have to give back the money that they got from the illegal case study. And honestly, they should. They didn't do the work. They wasn't the head of household in that home that... um that raise those, uh, raise the kids because it's family. They have kid or kids that, um, 
live home, live life, probably being gang stalked. Because that honestly reminds me of Secret Seven, to be honest. But you plug it in, how it resonates. That Gemini, love original Gemini, doesn't deserve to have the money. And that's just the damn truth. They didn't do the work. They were probably one of the weird lurkers going through the camera. Not one of the ones actually in the home having to deal with gang stalking and crazy ass community. And that's just the truth. Changes in your life. I think that's a low vibrational Gemini, but I have to give back this large amount of money for something they didn't damn do. And honestly, they should have to. A very significant court hearing is about to come up in a Gemini's life soon. A very significant court hearing is about to come up in a Gemini's life soon. So some kind of court hearing energy. Um, to me, that can go positive or negative, Gemini. Only you know your story, not anybody else, but that could be the world card energy as well. Cycle changes with the court hearing energy. Um, for some, it could be regarding sex videos. For some, it could be regarding um, the having to get back the money of the illegal case study energy. Or it can be anything else. You plug it in how it resonates. Celebration, fun, and enjoyment. A graduation that has already occurred is significant in a Gemini's life. For some, an upcoming graduation is about to become significant in a Gemini's life. For some, celebration off to college about to become significant in a Gemini's life. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. That's beautiful. So lots of celebrations here. Um, it could be you going off to college. You just graduated. You're about to graduate. Or it could be somebody you're connected to. But lots of past graduation energy already in the universe has already happened. Some upcoming graduation energy in the universe that's about to happen. And some celebration off to college energy. Now, you could be 18 going off to college or 48 going off to college. But celebration energy. I think going out, having a good time, celebrating this person, really celebrating their achievements there. Celebration, fun, and enjoyment. Celebrating this person, whether it's you or somebody you're connected to. And that's the way it should be. Um, when I graduated college at 30 years old, I remember the night I uh, graduated. I graduated from Calhoun Community College in 2013. My foster mother, at the graduation that evening, when I was walking across the stand, she yelled, thank God, just like that. And when we left the uh, auditorium, she didn't even take me out to dinner. I took me and my two kids out to dinner on my own dime. She didn't even offer to take me out to dinner. How, un how like, I would never do that to my kids, ever. Ever. But she did that to me. And that's the damn truth. So, whoever you are, I'm really, really proud of you. I'm really proud of you that you're about to celebrate somebody. Because they should be deserved to celebrate, celebrated. Because they went through such a wonderful celebration and achievement in their life. Absolutely. Don't be like my foster mother of the past. Don't be. Because I would never treat anybody like that. And I'm serious. Teardrops. Great personal sorrow. A death is about to become significant in a Gemini's life. And uh, Gemini is about to get called from an investiga investigator to provide more evidence on a cold case. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. A death is about to become significant in a Gemini's life. And one of you guys is about to get a call from an investigator. Sounds like a, sounds like a police investigator or a PI or something like that um, to provide more evidence on a cold case. So it sounds like you've already provided evidence or information on a cold case, but they're about to call, it sounds like upcoming universe about to call you again to provide more evidence. So great for personal sorrow. I feel is the cold case energy. I feel you might've been close to them, um, whoever this person is, and you're trying to help crack the case or get it solved or what have you, what have you. Um, and for some, it could be the death energy upcoming in the universe. That's going to give you lots of sorrow. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, you guys. 
A psychic is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. A psychic is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. So you plug in how it resonates. Well, shout out to the psychic medium energies. Um, I, I love my psychic medium community. So whoever the psychic is that's about to become significant in your life. I love us psychics. Just saying, just saying. Um, whoever it is and how it applies to you, Gemini. And in particular, Gemini is about to try to contact an Aries. Call after call after call after call after call. But you are not going to get an answer. But it's going to be for strategic reasons. Know this. Okay. So a psychic is about to become significant in one of you guys' life. And one of you guys, it sounds like you have recently connected with an Aries. A mask one of them Aries. They could have Aries in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, midham, or Jupiter charts. If that resonates for you, Gemini. I apologize. But I heard you're going to call after call after call after call. So you're going to basically blow up their phone line. Um, call, 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 call. But I heard they're not strategically answering. For very strategic reasons. And you're not going to be able to get hold of them. Know this. Okay, so they're not answering for very strategic reasons. So they're not going to answer your call. So if you are the... It sounds like this is upcoming. So if you are the one, masculine or femme Gemini, that's, and you know their placements and you know it's an Aries, and you're calling, 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 they're not answering. And you have tried and tried and tried, blew up the phone, blew up the phone, you're worried, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I heard um, it's an Aries energy, masculine or femme, that could have Aries in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, men, him, Jupiter charts, but I heard they're not strategically answering and they're not going to. So, um, you plug it in, how it resonates. It is somebody you know, whoever this Aries is. It's not a new energy. It is somebody you know, but they are strategically not answering for a reason. Just know that if that particular message applies for you there, Gemini, okay? Let's pull one kipper and then I'll close it. Look, we have on the bottom of the deck, change. Double confirmation for change, man. A lot of changes, and I mean quick changes. Holy crap. A news reporter is about to become very significant in Gemini's life soon. Some you're going to want them there, some you're not. Okay, I heard a news reporter is about to become very significant in Gemini's life soon. For some you're going to want them there, for some you're not. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Okay. Jail card. False person reverse. Number 29 or 8 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 29 or 8 could be possible age of you or a child you're connected to or any other significant number in one's life. 29 or 8. A, fair, uh, a Sagittarius energy, feminine energy is about to, through many series of chain events, about to go to jail soon for abuse. It is about to shock the hell out of you. For one, for one, you're going to help put them there. Oh, dear Lord. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, I heard a Sag energy is about to go to jail soon for um, abuse. Um, for one of you guys. It's going to shock the hell out of you. They're going to go to jail for abuse. But for one, you're going to help put them there. So only you know your story, not anybody else, Sag. It's a, I'm not Sag, Gemini. Um, they could have Sag in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them and Hammer, Jupiter charts. That's the jail energy. It's a Sag Femme. You're about to speak truth for the one that's about to help put the Sag there. It's a Sag Feminine energy. Um, they could have Sag in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them and Hammer, Jupiter charts. Older, Sag uh, older Sagittarius Femme energy. Older Sag Femme. So it's a 35 or above Sag Femme energy. One, you're about to speak the truth to put her there. And I'm just being for real. But one, you're going to be shocked that she's there. And you didn't speak the truth to help put her there. So you only you know your story, not anybody else. So, um, Gemini, whoever you are and how this res resonates. For some, it could be regarding sex or sex videos. For some, it could be the legal case study. For some, it could be anything else. Um, 
you plug it in how it resonates. And a particular Gemini is about to find out about a water sign, some already in jail, or some about to go to jail. Okay. And a particular Gemini, you're about to find out some about a water sign that's already in jail, sounds like, or one water sign, it sounds like upcoming in the universe, they're about to go to jail. So for some, one of these situations could resonate with some, two or two plus, only you know your story, not anybody else, but some kind of up... Um, for some of you guys, the water sign's already in jail. It sounds like already in jail now. For some, it's upcoming in the universe. They're about to go to jail. For some, you could provide information to help them go to jail. I don't know. Only you know the actions you're about to take in the universe. But however that resonates, you're about to find out they're either already in jail or they're about to upcoming, about to be in jail. You plug it in, how it resonates. This is your water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Masculine or feminine, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They could have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Man, Haven, and Jupiter charts. And then false person reversed, the truth being revealed, they're already in jail or they're about to go to jail. However, that resonates in one slide. All right, you guys, well, we're done. I hope this helps so much. A betrayal from a Leo masculine is about to turn around on them in a huge way. Betrayal of you, Gemini. Okay, I heard a betrayal of a Leo masculine. It's about to turn around. It sounds like on the Leo masculine, they betrayed you, Gemini. So you can be a masculine or feminine Gemini, but it's a Leo masculine energy. They betrayed you, but it's about to energetically boomerang back on them, Gemini. Um, it's about to backfire on their ass. It's a Leo masculine. They could have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, Moon, Haven, Jupiter charts. If that resonates for you, Sag, uh, Sag, Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. You have a lot of Sag in here. All right, love you guys. Namaste.